Well, hello again, everyone, and welcome into Noon Prayer on this Thursday of the first week of Lent. As I mentioned last week, or excuse me, last, uh, as I mentioned on Tuesday is what I'm trying to say, I'm struggling to do so, um, we are going to be journeying through Henry Nouwen's Lent devotions, Drawn to the Cross. Let us enter into God's courts. Our mutual mission. If then there is any encouragement in Christ, any consolation from love, any sharing in the Spirit, any compassion and sympathy, make my joy complete. Be of the same mind, having the same love, being in full accord. A reading from Philippians. Compassion is daring to acknowledge our mutual destiny so that we might move forward all together and to the land which God is showing us. Henry Nouwen continues, One might expect that everything would have gone smoothly in the congregations founded by St. Paul. But as you read Paul's letters to these churches, you witness the same fussing and infighting that many of us experienced in our own congregations. However, when God's redeemed and sanctified people humble themselves under the mighty hand of God, swallow their pride, and put Christ's plans and purposes first and foremost on their agendas, well, then amazing things can be accomplished for the good and growth of God's kingdom. This doesn't mean that everyone in the congregation will suddenly agree on every issue. But when we all have the same first love, that is our Lord Jesus Christ, and have the same priority, and that is carrying out his mission to seek and to save the lost, well then, his spirit can remold us into a faithful and fruitful family of believers. Through the Spirit's encouragement and guidance, we are able to set aside our personal feelings and agenda for the sake of our mutual mission. Let us pray. Holy Spirit, unite our hearts and minds in full accord to seek and to save the lost and to bring back those who have strayed. Amen. Well, okay, dear friends, I look forward to seeing you Sunday for the second Sunday in Lent. Our offerings for Eucharists are 8.30 a.m., 11 a.m., and 5 p.m., as is our practice. I look forward to seeing you then. Thanks be to God.